Together, I find myself forced to leave out certain details in order not to shock. But I urge you to hold back your judgment of us until you have finished my account and know the full and exact circumstances of how we fell into that way of life and found ourselves proclaimed bound up pirate, 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 pirate. My name is Ekundayo. Um, the name is Nigerian. It's a Yoruban language. It means sorrow becomes joy. Out of, out of, uh, out of sorrow, you can have joy. Just basically meaning like, you know, you know, you, uh, you kind of you shape your own life and out of our troubled experiences, we can either take those things and just have a troubled life or we can build something new and, and be happy, you know, and that's like what my name means and oddly enough, that's kind of how my life has gone and how I know a lot of other people's lives have gone and, um, and that's what I like to think, that's my main inspiration, my main focus. I think my main inspiration probably just came from like a need to kind of um, have some type of therapy because like after my pops died I was just like um, like kind of lost you know getting into a lot of trouble like school fights and all this kind of stuff and um, and you know the art and I guess graph really is what made it like um, what, what pushed me you know what pushed me and like kept me going and kept my mind in the positive you know and um, I had an uncle who wrote for a graph crew in LA and I was living with my sister at the time he wrote for like CHB and I remember I was like suspended for doing some shit and um, and I was up in the attic and I found this black book and it was like amazing like, every single like page in that book was just like hooked up to the next level and I just remember thinking like wow like I've never seen like art like this you know and so from there, I just started copying like every single page in that book. Like it just like took over me, you know. And I just started like I just really got into it, and I just really have have a love for the art, you know. And um, and from there, it's like all I wanted to do was paint, paint, and draw, you know. And I just kept doing it, kept pushing it, kept pushing it. It's been fun the whole time. It's like it's really a blessing to be able to do something that you love and be able to like live off of it, you know. So um, so yeah, that's like that's what inspired me. Yeah. Well, I've been, I've been pretty fortunate in the way that um, when I went to art school, um, I got the ball rolling like right away. Like I didn't really wait to finish school. I started um, showing at small galleries and then those small galleries started introducing me to other galleries and I started meeting other artists who've been doing it and just like learning from the way that they do it. And um, through that, like I've had a bunch of great opportunities. Like I got to design um, some artwork for, for Lincoln Park. Um, I'm working on an album cover for Fat John, which is like one of my favorite music producers. And um, yeah, little things have just been like popping up, like um, slowly but surely. You know, the more that I do it, I notice the more doors open up for me. You know? Yeah, the cut. Well, the colors always started out for me is like um, the way that things today and like things have always kind of been sometimes people try to sugarcoat things when they're not really too good and they use like bright colors or like really uh, catchy slogans to kind of pull you in and that's kind of like how I use my colors I like to use like wild crazy colors to like get people looking and then when they look it's like a lot of my paintings all of them like have some type of meaning or concept behind it and a lot of it comes from my own personal background like stuff that I've gone through and I like to tie all that stuff into my paintings, like being on the run for seven years or whatever. Like during that time, I like seen and, and did a bunch of crazy stuff. And that stuff always is like running through my head. So the art has always been from day one as a, as a means of therapy. And I just like kind of work those concepts out um, in my paintings, you know? This is Ekundao from the Ground Up Pirates. Putting it down, we're about to take it all the way up to the top. Family style, you know? Doing big things.